Jason Eigelberger here, Prep Pal Track. I am with the ladies of J. Sarah High School, who successfully defend their Division IV state championship here today, the fifth state championship in program history. First and foremost, ladies, congratulations. Thank you. Uh, you guys come in uh, from day one this season. This has been the goal. This has been something you guys have all been shooting for. Just take us through what this feeling is like to accomplish this part of your season goal. Um, it just feels great to be able to accomplish this. It really means all of our hard, hard work early mornings, bowls of pasta that we didn't want to eat for races. <laughs> Everything that we put into this has really just gone to this day. Um, we're so excited that we got to share with our seniors. We love them so much, and I just wouldn't have wanted to do it with anyone else, and it just feels great to be here and to accomplish our goal. For you guys to come here, again, with the target on your back, knowing that everybody in the division is shooting for you, being that defending state champion, and knowing that if anybody has an off day or things of that nature, you got teams right on your heels. And obviously, Division Four, very, very strong this year. Talk a little bit about that sense of accomplishment to come in here today and to get that victory, knowing the caliber of opponents that you guys ran against today. Well, I think Division Four has a lot of just amazing competitors. And um, just having them in our division allows us to push ourselves to the roots. I mean, if it wasn't for them, we wouldn't have performed our best this season 100% because, you know, they make, like, they allow us to just absolutely just go out there and run our best. And I think that um, because of them, you know, we're able to do things like this. So we're very grateful that we have a competitive division and we're so grateful to be able to race against so many amazing and talented um, teams. Now coming into this today, was there any point in the race where a coach and you guys, when you were going over your race plan, said, hey, as a unit, as a team, we have to be successful to execute here, and where was that point on the course? Um, I would say that we always know going into a race that no matter how hard it gets out there, the, the accomplishment that we're going to have is w way greater than any pain that we're experiencing on that course, um, especially when it gets super hard out there. You know, We love this each other so much. We love our coaches. We love our families that came here to support us. So um, if we can't do it for ourselves, we know that we'll do it for them. And I think any, any time we're out there, even if I'm able to see a couple of my teammates out there, we're very encouraging. We're able to um, keep one, one another up and say, I'm going to go right now. You're going to come right with me. And I think that's something great that we have with our team. And I think just coming along the back stretch, like I had Brooke coming up with me and finishing. And then I had Georgia right behind me. I can see Summer and Kayla out in front of me killing it. And it doesn't matter where, each, where any of us are in the course. We know that we're there with one another kind of in spirit. And we know that we're cheering each other along the way 100% of the time. So, and then we are all meet up at the finish line together to uh, celebrate this awesome victory right now. You guys are a part of obviously something extremely special. Um, now a, a defending state champion. Talk a little bit about what that's like uh, to have been a part of that, for some of you guys to be a part of that moment of winning back-to-back -back state championships, really cementing yourselves as one of Orange County's best all-time teams and also one of, of the best all-time teams for Division Four. I, I feel like it gives us a competitive edge, like each practice. I feel like every time we go into a race, we're thinking not just, oh, we want to like win this race. We're thinking we want to improve perform our best for state and for all the races to come. So I feel like it just gives us drive each race. Um, I'd also like to add to the previous statements um, just how grateful we are for our families and um, also our other teammates who came out here to support us because we have that deep team and um, there were opportunities for other people to run as well and we just want to thank them for coming here and being with us and it's really important to us. And, um, they push us in practice, they push us in other races, and so we could be more grateful for the girls on the team. So they're on top of the mountain in Division 4, a lot left in the tank, and we look forward to seeing what they have in store next. Again, your 2022 Division 4 California State Champions, J. Sarah Lyons. Ladies, congratulations. Thank you.